To present our next award, please welcome the Ambassador of Americana, Charles Phoenix. Good evening and welcome. Thank you. It is the age, uh-oh, we're not there yet. That's okay. How's everybody doing tonight so far? Wait, am I the only one in this room that keeps waiting for this chandelier to come down and a bunch of birds to start singing to us? I know. Why do I feel like the Little Mermaid with all these bubbles up here? Am I the only one? Here it is. It is the age of space. The year is 1967, and we have just landed in the most modern metropolis in the entire universe. The theme building was the centerpiece and the crowning touch of the 1961 jet age expansion of LAX. I love the two people having a moment, the car show in the parking lot, the yellow cab, but I am worried that now that Encounter's restaurant has closed, they're gonna paint the entire thing the color of the yellow cab, and it's gonna be the world's most amazing McDonald's. You never know. All right, tonight we are presenting the Thea Award to the immersive media installation at the new Tom Bradley Terminal of Los Angeles International Airport. This installation is a fully integrated intelligent media environment, which includes a 72-foot tall four-sided time tower, welcome and voyage walls, and other elements in passenger, passenger service and shopping locations. The, the first of its kind installation adapts new departure locations, so passengers in the terminal see thematically appropriate imagery on the six millimeter pitch HD LED video walls. I know. Custom content was filmed or created for each surface to inform and entertain passengers, just like you and me. Behind the scenes, dozens of individual media servers hold a variety of informational clips and spectacular visual segments. Best of all, the presentations are scalable and the infrastructure for control from smartphone apps and other interactive platforms means the passengers will be able to impact content on the ever-changing videoscape. Well, isn't that nice? This forward-looking project utilizes state-of-the-art technology and sophisticated design, setting a new standard for immersive public spaces. September 2013. The new Tom Bradley International Terminal opens to the public. Inside the terminal, the largest media installation at any airport in the Americas. The goal? Enhance the passenger experience. Bring back the magic and romance of travel. The Time Tower is the centerpiece of the new terminal. It's constantly evolving from an architectural icon to a tribute to the silent film era to an art piece that expresses a floating, dreamy time of travel. As the clock strikes the hour, an immersive moment of wonder that spreads to other features. Floating above the main hall as passengers enter, the storyboard tells atmospheric tales from Los Angeles and destinations both real and imagined. A new generation of departure displays, the destination board shows not just outbound flights, but also visualizations of real-time data from LAX destinations. The interactive portals react to passenger movements as people head to their gates. The artwork, music, and effects are linked to real-time flight data. They change to reflect the destinations of outbound flights. Arriving in Los Angeles, passengers are greeted by the luminous welcome wall, an invigorating splash of energy eight stories high. Just after the security lineups, the Bon Voyage wall is a moment of suspension that marks the transition into the terminal. Seven media features, one vision. A new kind of public space, a new form of brand experience, a place where passengers' journeys start long before they board their planes.
for its incredibly creative use of technology and media in, a, in an environmental space, the Thea Award of Achievement is presented to LAX World Airport's Integrated Environmental Media. Accepting the award for LAX Integrated Environmental Media is Los Angeles Airport's Deputy Executive Director, Michael Desette, and Stefan Ville, Managing Partner of Smart Monkeys Incorporated. Thank you very much. It's, uh, it's a real honor to be here today to uh, receive this re reward on behalf of Los Angeles World Airports. I will say we've been working really, really hard over the past few years to try and make LAX a place that you actually want to pass through and enjoy on your way to whatever your future destination is. We realize we have a long ways to go in that uh, regard, but I think this award is vindication that we're we are moving in the right direction. So hopefully you'll see additional great things to come. Uh, one of the things I'd like to do is really thank the project team that put this all together, who worked tirelessly to pull this all together. And it really started with the, uh, the former executive director, Gina Marie Lindsay, who took a big chance without a lot of information to green light this project and move it forward. And then the actual design team themselves, uh, Mike Rubin with MRA, uh, Marcel Sardi, who did the design of the actual features themselves and was part of the creative team for that. And then the lead technical designer, Smart Monkeys, with Stefan Veillet and Alan Anderson out there. Um, we had some wonderful content producers who produced that original content that's showing on there. Uh, that was led by Moment Factory, uh, Saki Bisset, Francois Morel. Um, Mark Andre, who's here this evening, and uh, Marie, I know I saw you earlier, part of Forest Lumina, you'll see a little bit later. We also had Digital Kitchen on board that helped uh, Erica Coates and um, was instrumental in pulling that together. And then finally, the, the team that really integrated that was Electrosonic, uh, Brian Hinckley, I have here today, and Janine Hamill, his uh, project manager for that, who are the ones who really pulled this together and made that sing. So once again, very thankful and appreciative of this award, and thank you very much.